We are exposed to a complex mixture of chemicals in our daily lives through the environment, consumer products, food and drinking water, and at work. While some of these intentionally used chemicals help make our lives comfortable and safe, they can have a negative impact on our health. Like other substances that are non-intentionally released in the environment food human continuum. At workplaces, substances may be released by the work processes. Others, such as asbestos, crude oil, and grain dust, come from natural sources. Equally, some food constituents or pharmaceutical products may also present risks to workers. In the workplace, exposure can occur in all sectors, from factories to farms at construction sites, when cleaning, in healthcare, and in the hairdressing sector. Chemicals considered in our project Human Biomonitoring for Europe, HBM4EU, occur when welding, in the automotive industry, and in the chemical industry. In textile industry, certain chemicals are used to coat the fabrics. In the plastic and cosmetic industries, plasticizers like phthalates are used to make their products soft and flexible. Bisphenols are used in the construction industry. Both chemicals, phthalates and bisphenols, are endocrine disruptors. Once inside the body, they have a negative impact on cognitive and behavioral development of children, depending on the level and duration of exposure. Chemical exposure at the workplace can occur through three routes. Inhalation. Some chemicals can be inhaled, like metal fumes containing chromium-6 and solvents styrene and different toxic gases. Skin. Other chemicals can be absorbed through the skin, like cleaning products or solvents. Workers who do wet work, using water or solvents that can break down the skin's natural defense barrier, are at particular risk from this exposure pathway. Orally. Toxic metals like lead, mercury, or chromium-6 enter the body orally. All workers need to be equally protected. However, the particular sensitivity or conditions of some groups of workers might be overlooked, and they may therefore be more at risk. The risk might be higher because these workers are inexperienced, uninformed, or physically more vulnerable, or because they frequently change jobs. Groups exposed to particular risks may include women, young workers, migrant workers, and workers who are less likely to have received training and information. Pregnant women need special protection from chemicals at workplaces, since exposure during the prenatal period is known as particularly affecting human health both short and long term. HBM4EU's aim is to support efforts to protect European workers from chemicals that can cause many different types of harm, some of which are potentially very serious, such as cancer, reproductive disorder, and birth defects and asthma. Harm from hazardous substances can arise from a single short exposure, from long-term exposure, or from the long-term accumulation of substances in the body. How do we learn more about the exposure towards chemicals at workplace, and how do we keep exposure levels safe? Human Biomonitoring HBM, is a scientific technique that allows us to assess whether and to what extent hazardous substances have entered our bodies and how exposure may be changing over time. By measuring the concentration of natural and synthetic compounds in body fluids or tissues, Biomonitoring can provide valuable information on environmental or occupational exposures and, in some cases, help identifying potential health risks. How to live in a chemical work world Fortunately, not all chemicals are harmful to health, and the European Union has established regulations to protect us. The most important pieces of EU legislation regulating chemical exposure at workplaces are Chemical Agents Directive, and Carcinogens and Mutagens Directive, which lay down minimum requirements for the protection of workers from risks to their safety and health arising from chemical agents at the workplace. To protect workers from hazardous substances, a workplace risk assessment is needed. Then, actions should be taken to remove or reduce the risks as far as possible. European worker protection legislation establishes a hierarchy of measures that employers must follow elimination and substitution of the substance itself, followed by technical and organizational measures, and only as a last resort, personal protective measures. Another important regulation is REACH, 
registration, evaluation, authorization, and restriction of chemicals. REACH addresses the production and use of chemicals and defines, for example, what information on the hazardous properties of the chemicals should be provided in the safety data sheets. HBM4EU is delivering data to support the improvement of the relevant legislations to protect workers by developing occupational research studies and sharing their results with the policymakers. Relevant scientific concepts, such as green chemistry and sustainable chemistry, focus on designing products and processes to minimize or eliminate the use and the generation of hazardous substances for the benefit of the citizens and the workers. The European Union is now introducing new legislation in a number of areas, including chemicals, biodiversity, food systems, and green products to ensure citizens have a toxic-free environment. A transition to a more circular economy is also foreseen, shifting the focus to reusing, repairing, refurbishing, and recycling existing materials and products. This is part of the European Green Deal, an initiative of the European Commission to cut pollution, restore biodiversity, and ensure the safe and sustainable use of chemicals contributing to a clean chemical flow in a circular economy. To reach these goals, HBM4EU will fill in the research gaps and make human biomonitoring even more effective by working together with scientists to improve access to data for regulators and provide scientific-based support for workplace risk assessment. HBM4EU will also develop a process where regulators and policymakers can actively participate in choosing which substances are prioritized for monitoring, resulting in the safe management of chemicals. HBM4EU is for you. We are working together to improve your health.